you and I am from 3G Cream. I am 8 years old and I'm going to talk about why I recommend Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I personally think that Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire is an overpowering book. It is the fourth book of the Harry Potter series and it talks about facing challenges, standing up for what's right, and not giving up on the good. I really recommend this book for people who like fantasy. So, um, I would like to talk to you about a favorite book, um, one of my favorite books of all times. Um, I read this when I was very young um, and it's, I still remember it now to this day. And it's this wonderful story written by Jack London. It was written in the early 1900s. So the language is kind of old style language, but it's still very, very easy to read. And it's a wonderful book that I would recommend to anybody because it's a, um, a very kind of um, uh, inspirational story. And it's the story of a dog. And um, it kind of follows the life of this dog. And the dog's name is Buck. And he has this comfortable life and then some things happen to him and it's about how he deals with all his problems and what happens in the end and i'm not going to tell you what happens in the end but it's a wonderful story and it's about the relationship between um, the dog and humans and um it's very um uh, memorable story and it's very also very famous it's now considered a classic and um, where was I going to say next? You need to cut that part out. <laughs> All right, so I'd recommend this book to anyone, actually. Um, in fact, I've even recommended this book to my father. But I'd recommend it to anyone who is um, interested in animals because it's a really interesting view of, um, from an animal's perspective about the relationships between um, dogs and humans. And it's also a, a little bit of history. It's about um, the Klondike and the gold rush um, in the early 1900s with the author Jack London. He lived there for a while. So it's a bit of background on, on the, um, the setting of um, the Klondike Gold Rushes and what went on there. And I would recommend it to any young people as a very inspirational book and anyone else who, um, who really wants a really good classic read. And um, I'm, I'll be surprised if anyone didn't enjoy this book. Okay, hello everyone, my name is Aiden Kim and I want to recommend, recommend this book called The 39 Clothes. This book is like, there's a lot of book series, like, it, ha it even though like there's like four series in it, and then it's, and then this is the first series, and then even the first series had like, like 10, 10 books in one series, so it's a very large quantity, and then, and then each, even though this is in the same series, it is all from different authors. So for example, this is the book one, and this is from Rick Riordan, which is the author of Percy Jackson series, which is a very good fantasy. And this book is about, this book is about a girl which is 14 years old, and her younger brother, which is 12 years old, going going through the clue to find, find out the recipe to a serum that can make, make whoever drinks it into a most powerful person in the world. Um, I am going to recommend this book to the kids who, is actually, who, who actually loves mystery and non I mean fiction. It is it is actually c come from a fiction, but it is but it is actually very mysterious and it's like finding a clue just like Sherlock Holmes.